We are reminded in James chapter 1, verse 17, where it says that every good and perfect gift comes from above. In Genesis chapter 2, verse 18, it says, And the Lord God said, It is not good that man should be alone. I will make him a helper comparable to him. I told my brother today when he was getting ready, I said, You outdid yourself today. And he said to me, he looked at me and he said, I don't have anything to do with this. He was like, this is God. Knowing James in this past several months that we had the opportunity to have you in Florida, it was the greatest thing that you could have ever done. Now I can call you my son-in-law. I love you. There's something special about this guy right here. I can't even express the feeling I have towards this young man. For the feeling that I feel for him, if he can have that feeling for someone else, anything's possible. James Booba, I can't believe this day is finally here. We've been praying seeking God and working through so much just to get to this day. And this is just the beginning of our lives. I noticed you the other day. But I'm so awkward, I just walk the other way You independent like your dad, but got your mother's face We could be the couple, other couples of the hate I knew the moment that Becca started telling me about James that he was the one For starters, I have never heard the word marriage come out of her mouth until she met this man <laughs> Technically, I lost my job coming here tonight, guys so I'll just let you know I told my manager, look this is the wedding I have to be at. Do whatever you want. Let me know where I need to sign because this guy is my guy. Everyone, please raise your glass and cheers to the newlyweds. wedding this is my like this is the best wedding ever right here yeah can't get around the applause with james and rebecca uh james and rebecca Bear, let's go Today, surrounded by people we love, I choose you to be my husband. I vow to respect, honor, and be faithful to you and only you all the days of my life. Rebecca, as I stand before you today, I'm still in awe that God saw fit to bless me with one of his daughters. I am once again reminded of how great that our God is. With that, I vow to love you forever and always. Take your time and build a solid foundation, just the two of you, and enjoy every moment together. Let's raise a glass to Rebecca and James. May your troubles be less and your blessings be more, but nothing but happiness come through your door. Cheers. The gracious Father God, we give you thanks for your gift of enduring love and your presence here today. We welcome you into this room, into their lives, not only today, but always.
love you so much. And I'm so excited to spend the rest of my life with you. Today is one of the best days of my life because today I become your husband. I give you all that I have. Myself, myself and my love. All these things pledge to you. Me.